Chapter 9, Mishnah 8. We have learned that Mechatas transmits Tuma to things that it touches. This Mishnah discusses the Tuma status of Mechatas that became unfit. Mechatas that became unfit for use still make Tame someone who is Tahor for Teruma, whether he touches the unfit Mechatas with his hands or with some other part of his body. But with regard to someone who is Tahor for Mechatas, the unfit Mechatas do not make him Tame, neither if he touches them with his hands nor if he touches them with his body. The Mishnah has discussed the Tumah status of Mechatas that became unfit. Now the Mishnah discusses the Tumah status of Mechatas that became Tame. If Mechatas became Tame, such as by touching a sheretz or some other source of Tumah, they make Tame someone who is Tahor for Terumah, whether he touches them with his hands or with some other part of his body. This is because Mechatas that are Tame are unfit for use. And as we learned in the first part of this Mishnah, Mechatas that are unfit make Tame someone who is Tahor for Terumah whether he touches them with his hands or with some other part of his body. But with regard to someone who is Tahor for Mechatas, the Mechatas that are Tame make him Tame if he touches them with his hands, but not if he touches them with his body.